Today's project is going to be to replace my agro drive belts on my snowblower. As you can see, the belts wore right through the, the belt cover. So we're going to pop this off. I, I did purchase a new one, $15. The part number is listed. And there's one bolt here. You can see, and on the other side, there are two. Let's have a quick peek. see it very well. There's one there and there's another one inside here. You can't see. I have my fingers on it. And one here. So we'll pop those off. And we'll take that belt cover off and see what we're looking at. Not necessary, but I'm going to pop this uh, spark plug out just to um, get rid of the compression when we're playing with the belt. So step one, we're going to take this thing out. So we tipped the snowblower up just so we'd have a better, better angle on getting at the uh, the belts from behind here. These just come out. Took the we took the cover off. You can see there, no problem. Got that off. Three screws. Three little bolts and one more here and we'll get a better view of the uh, of the belts from the bottom. The auger on this snowblower on this system uses two belts so this one here see where my finger is this belt there that wheel is where one of the the belt was that broke and there's another one on here and we just had this thing going and it's got a couple little nicks out of it uh, I don't like it, and uh, there's no point in having one extra one over here that I'm not going to use. Right, so I, I think what we'll do, and we'll show this, is we'll put both of them on. So, so I'm starting fresh, two new belts. Okay, just so you can see, we're going to feed the belt through, and we're going to line it up on this big wheel here first. And I'll just show you on the front. You can go ahead there if you want. By pushing this in and out, it gives gives us a little more slack. So there it is. You can see it coming through. I'll see if I can. It's going to go underneath. See if I can do it with one hand. I don't know how steady. I don't have another set of hands for the camera, so it might not be very steady. But you'll get an idea. And that is going. I'm not sure that's clear. Do you want me to put my end on first, or you? No, no, no I got to put mine on first. It does go ahead. You put yours on, and let's see. So the first belt goes on the bottom big wheel, and feed it through, and it's going to go on here eventually, but we have to get the second belt on this big wheel here from the back, same idea as the first one, but it's got to come up underneath, or actually it's going to come through here and, and down from here, so we can't we can't attach this one, this belt yet, until we put this one on, and then we'll just lift this bottom belt up. Okay. Second belt getting fed through. Okay. Good. Okay, so this I is. Stand, oh no, I can put no. the spring back on and stand it up now if you want. It might be easier. Uh, uh, this is okay. So this is what we were talking about. This one here on the bottom, the bottom big, the first belt, I guess depending on which way you're looking at it, the first one we put on anyway. Can't get on tight. We have to take this guy, which is the top one, and put it on. Except, I'm, again, I'm working with one hand here. That goes up there. Come here for a sec. I want to get this so I can see. If I pull that back, that loosens that up. Can you just, uh, again, I'm going with one hand. Go ahead and put that up on the top. I'll pull this back to give you some slack. So we want to put that, put that one up on the top, yeah. There. Now you 
told you. I'm sure there's a mechanical uh, tool that would make this a little easier, but we don't have it. So we got the top one on. Just pull that easy, which is why it's nice to have your spark plug out. Oh yeah. Pull that easy and that just kind of gave us the the give we were looking for. So there's our belts on. So we're just gonna reassemble and we should be good to go. We'll show you the reassembly just quickly though. And uh, this should work. Oh here, you wanna put that plate on? Oh yeah. So I guess yeah, before we bring that down, I don't have to show you this. We're just going to put our plate back on. The spring back on, yeah. We took that spring off. That's, that gave us lots of play in that wheel, so that was an important little thing. I don't know if I showed you that earlier, but take that spring off and it allows us to kind of give us some play with that, with that wheel. Okay, uh, put this plate on here, and then we're going to put her down. And we'll put our new little plate on that, uh, that I purchased to replace the one that the belts broke, broke through.